Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave The City of Champlin recently held a proclamation ceremony out at Andrews Park, recognizing the community achievement of becoming a Beyond the Yellow Ribbon City. Beyond the Yellow Ribbon is a comprehensive program that creates awareness for the purpose of connecting service members and their families with community support, training, services, and resources. We're gonna take a brief break, but after we return, we will hook up with City Council Member Bruce Miller who has a few more words on the city of Champlin becoming a beyond the yellow ribbon city. Hey, I'm just leaving now. Can you text me the details? Thanks. Hi, my name is Bruce Miller. I'm on the Champlin City Council. This is my lovely wife, Kim. And uh, I don't know if you've seen it before or after this interview, but she sang the national anthem tonight, and I tell you, I couldn't have been more proud. Were you nervous? Yes, I was nervous, and I was very privileged to have done that for the city of Champlin and for our veterans. Thank you. And speaking of that, I just want to thank everybody that was involved in the, helping us become a Beyond the Yellow Ribbon City. Uh, I'm on the steering committee, as are several other people, but there's plenty of room for more people to get involved. Uh, we had to go through a uh, more or less testing period before we uh, were accredited for it. And we had the ceremony for it tonight. Last week we officially got the proclamation at the city council. But I just want to say thanks to everybody who uh, helped make this possible. And most of all, I want to say thank you to the veterans and their families for all that you do for our country. And we really appreciate it. And anything we can do as a community and or as individuals to help you out, please contact us, let us know. We'll be getting a web page up soon, and we'll also be getting a uh, Facebook page. So with that, unless you have anything you want to add to that, I just want to say thanks to everybody for being here tonight and making this a great celebration. And thank all of you for watching. Have a great evening.